What Arsenal star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has made, clear as Mikel Arteta eyes signing. Arsenal star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has reportedly made it clear he will only leave the Emirates Stadium on his own terms. The Gabon international hasn't played for the Gunners since the defeat to Everton at the beginning of December. But despite his relationship with Mikel Arteta crumbling, there's no guarantee he'll leave North London before the transfer window shuts on Monday. Arsenal have seen Aubameyang regress since giving their number 14 a new contract back in the summer of 2020. At the time, it seemed the right call. The Gabon international had helped fire the club to FA Cup glory that same year, giving Arteta a first trophy of his reign in the process. Ever since, however, Aubameyang's form has waned. And he's been out in the cold at Arsenal ever since the beginning of December, with his last match being the 2-1 defeat to Everton at Goodison Park. Now, the Sun say Aubameyang has made it clear to the club he will only leave on his own terms, just like Mesut Ozil before him. Ozil was also left out in the cold by Arteta, but refused to leave initially before later securing a dream move to Fenerbus. Think you know sport? Test your sporting knowledge with our tricky quiz Aubameyang has been linked with a move to the Middle East, with two clubs currently showing interest. Al Nasser and Al Hilal are both willing to pay the 32-year-old a weekly wage of £250,000 a week on loan. And they're also prepared to pay a fee of £8 million to land the Borussia Dortmund star permanently at the end of the campaign. Yet Aubameyang feels he's still capable of playing at the highest level, even if the stats suggest he's a faded force. AC Milan are another option for the forward, who has been at Arsenal ever, since moving from Dortmund back in January 2018. Don't miss four Man United players West Ham could accept in Rice swap deal Abramovich backs punishment for Chelsea striker Lukaku six players Liverpool could axe this year however, they'd have to pay him double, what Zlatan Abrahamovic currently pockets over at the San Siro. And with Milan a harmonious place to be again, it's possible they'll choose to place their faith in alternative targets instead. Arsenal do want a late signing, however, regardless of what happens with Aubameyang. But they'll struggle to get one in before Monday, with the clock now ticking. Arsenal had been hoping to win the race for Fiorentina's Vlahovic, who has scored 17 goals from 21 Serie A matches this term. Juventus are, however, now expected to secure the arrival of the prolific Serbian. Arsenal have decided against moving for Luka Jovic, who has struggled for consistency throughout the entirety of his Real Madrid career. And they also consider Real Sociedad's Alexander Isak to be too expensive. Meanwhile, former Arsenal hitman Emmanuel Adebayor has recently had his say on Aubameyang's situation. And he's launched a stinging attack on his old side, insisting the Gunners can't forgive. I know he's going through a lot, because that's Arsenal for you, Adebayor told Sky Sports. They never knew how to forgive, so I know he went through a lot. He's a fantastic player, I wish him all the best, I've sent him a message already. We just want him to bounce back. Whether we like it or not, he's an African brother, and we want him to keep representing Africa the way he was doing before. Adebayor also expressed a belief that Aubameyang